The Academy Awards have not featured a host for the past three years, but three female comedic actors will reportedly helm the ceremony this year. Wanda Sykes, Amy Schumer and Regina Hall are in final discussions about hosting the ceremony, according to a report by Variety. However, it's yet to be confirmed. Details about the ceremony will be announced on US broadcaster ABC's Good Morning America later today. ABC, owned by Walt Disney Co., is hosting the ceremony that, because of the time difference, will be broadcast in Australia in the morning of March 28 on Channel 7. The ceremony will return to its longtime home, Dolby Theatre in Hollywood, after last year's event was scaled down because of the pandemic. Last week, Variety reported the Academy would not require people attending the ceremony to show proof of vaccination. Attendees will have to return a negative COVID-19 test before entering, with unvaccinated guests reportedly being subject to additional and more stringent testing requirements. Who is Wanda Sykes? Sykes has a long list of comedy credits to her name. Supplied, Wanda Sykes Facebook. A stand-up comedian with ties to curb your enthusiasm, Sykes was a writer for The Chris Rock Show, has a recurring role in Blackish, appeared in Broad City and stars in the Netflix sitcom The Upshaws, which she created. On the big screen, she's appeared in Bad Moms and Monster in Law. She has also lent her voice to animated characters in the Ice Age franchise and cartoons such as BoJack Horseman, Bob's Burgers and The Simpsons. Sykes is an executive producer for the Netflix series The Upshaws. Supplied, Netflix. Who is Amy Schumer? Schumer teased her hosting gig with a post on her Instagram yesterday. Facebook, Amy Schumer. Schumer also rose to fame as a stand-up comedian, appearing on television shows such as Curb Your Enthusiasm and 30 Rock before winning an Emmy for her variety sketch show Inside Amy Schumer in 2015. She's also starred in films such as Snatched, I Feel Pretty and Trainwreck, which she also wrote. Schumer has teased the possibility of the hosting gig on her Instagram, posting a reel of career highlights with the caption Big News Coming Yesterday. Schumer starred with Bill Hader in Trainwreck. Supplied. Who is Regina Hall? Hall has had a long career in comedy. Reuters, Mike Blake. Hall's career kicked off with her role as Brenda in the horror spoof Scary Movie, and despite her character's serious repeated injuries, she went on to appear in three more installments of the franchise. She has also appeared in Blackish, with roles in Black Monday and Nine Perfect Strangers, plus credits in Ally McBeal and Law and & Order, LA. Hall worked with Will Packer, who will be producing the awards show in the film Girls Trip. You might remember Hall from Nine Perfect Strangers. Supplied, Amazon Prime Video. Were there other plans for the ceremony? Packer was weighing up a three-act structure with three sets of MCs. He was supposedly in talks with John Hamm about hosting, but Variety reports the Madman actor exited discussions over the weekend. Former hosts Chris Rock and Steve Martin were also invited to take part, but according to the New York Times, scheduling conflicts foiled those plans. There were suggestions Spider-Man stars Tom Holland and Zendaya could host the awards after the film updates Twitter account asked who would be a good for the job. But while Holland told The Hollywood Reporter in December he'd love to host the awards if he was asked, that clearly didn't come to fruition. Public vote on new awards. There's also been two new awards added to the Oscars lineup this year, which will be decided by a public vote. Loading. The Oscars fan favorite asks for people's favorite movie of 2021, while the Oscars Cheers Moment Award will go to movie fans' most cheerworthy moment in a film ever. However, it looks like the competition is only open to US movie fans. Wait, why were there no Oscars hosts? The last time the Oscars had a host was in 2018. Kevin Hart had been confirmed as the 2019 host, but when homophobic comments he'd made on Twitter almost 10 years prior resurfaced, the Academy gave him an ultimatum. Kevin, apologize for your tweets or we're going to have to move on and find another host, Hart said he was told. 
Hart said he passed on that apology because he said he'd addressed the comments several times before, but still made a point of apologizing when he announced he wasn't going to host the ceremony. Loading So the 2019 ceremony went on without a host for only the second time in the ceremony's long history. The host-free ceremony was so successful it was repeated in 2020, putting a greater focus on the individual presenters and big musical numbers, the Academy said. Last year's ceremony was also hostless. The COVID-19 crisis had a major impact on the event, which was held at a historic Los Angeles train station in front of a small audience. ABC with wires, 